Greetings YouTube, I have been fidgeting with this opening for 20 minutes and the way that it was recorded is just bizarre. This is a good friend of mine, Rad Bad Dad, who, uh, it's almost like a cinematic experience. You, you have the, the like, uh, black bars around all the sides, but you can see text beneath it, which is why it was edited this way. So we're just going to kind of commentate with it and see what happens. Before starting the arena grind for Hercules, I decided to buy a batch of 10 featured calves. Okay. Obviously, he got lucky because he's showing us an image. Knowing Hercules' sig ability is amazing, tries to get a dupe. Okay, so now he's zoomed together. That's a pretty cool edit. And a five-star Ronin is nothing to shake your head at to start. I really do feel like this is like an intimate, intimate eavesdropping on a crystal opening, if there is such a thing. Alright, second one is a four star. Obviously no Hercules yet, but there's eight crystals to go. When you think you're going to have to grind the arena all weekend and instead you get the champion, I don't care if they're a five star... I mean, six star in this I have mixed feelings about because it's a true puzzle piece champion from the sound of it. Hercules really does need to be SIG 200 to, to fully appreciate his utility and potential. And SIG 200 six stars, at least in my book, are only possible about three days a year. Spring cleaning maybe, but really just July 4th weekend and Cyber weekend. Uh, five star Nexus is always a beautiful thing when it pops up. We have opened so many 5-star Nexus on this channel for a 5-star uh, Red Guardian or a 5-star, at the latest, Hunt for the Flaming Jar. Nothing yet. And what's up, 4-star Hitmonkey? 6-star Bishop would also be really exciting. but Can't always get what you want. Alright, 5 more. Five Moss. Cinco Moss. Uh, three star Satan herself. All right, so you're down to the last four. So far, this has been, I'm not going to say an average crystal opening because an average doesn't have a five star nexus, but it doesn't have any six stars. So a slightly above average crystal opening. But all it takes is one crystal at the end. And what? Sorry, Mama Bear. Oh, that's hilarious. I can't wait to send this to Mama Bear. Duped a six-star Apocalypse. Look, man, I don't care if you get Hercules at this point in the last three, but if you get Apocalypse and Hercules, it'd be stupid lucky. Here's the four-star. And after a six-star Apocalypse, you get a five-star Iceman. This is a wonderful last batch of four. All right, Sig 41? Clearly you used a uh, Awakening Gym on him once upon a time. Can't blame you there. Two more. And a five-star dorm. It's like you're on the campus of Duke. And last one. Also, professional blur on the message. First time somebody's done that. Your editing skills are improving, my friend. Last crystal. The very, very last crystal. A second six star. And it's a second six star mutant. Didn't get the Hercules dupe, but a featured calf dropping 20% six stars and 40% five stars is a win. Are you going to show us the Nexus? There we go. Nick Fury. Oh man, this is like Mama Bear's nightmare. Six star dupe of Apocalypse and Nick Fury. And of course, at the end, the, the opening looks like it's a bigger full screen than it was. Wow. Well, he went for Hercules, and as he said at the beginning, he showed a, uh, a six-star Hercules. Um, I guess that might have been from the early access bundle. I don't know. Either way... I got lucky. Not a sentence I ever really muttered in college, but congratulations on that, my friend. Uh, there you have it, YouTube. I'm uh, thankful to have had the honor of commentating this very creative and 
well edited video. I'm sorry if it felt like it was a little bit harder to see, especially for those of you watching on smaller devices, but it was kind of a cinematic feel, especially with the text underneath, and that is a pretty unique way to edit this for a crystal opening commentary submission. We've done a lot of these on this channel over the years. Have a great one. Thanks again to my good friend here, Rad Bad Dad, for the crystal opening commentary submission. I hope you enjoyed it.